we see the LNG as a fuel for the future. And uh, the main benefit uh, is the less uh, environmental impact using this fuel, so we will have a less, uh, less emissions. Because the ship will be operated in the uh, emission control area when we are operating all our ships, so uh, the advantage of the liqui liquefied natural gas, which is LNG, is that we will have uh, uh, less uh, sulfur emissions uh, and less uh, CO2 emissions even with uh, using the LNG. And uh, uh, the fuel itself uh, contains uh, more energy than the uh, normal marine diesel oil. So, and uh, we see that uh, mm, uh, introducing our megastar uh, in this area will also create uh, uh, more uh, uh, supply chain possibilities for the LNG in this area and uh, creating maybe uh, more possibilities also to other ship owners to introduce ships using LNG. When you are using uh, gas, people are thinking, is it, is it safe? Yeah, LNG has been used uh, on board ships more than 10 years already. So we have made uh, different kind of risk assessment. Uh, of course, the crew should be well trained. Uh, the bunkering companies should be well experienced. We should consider that uh, LNG will be stored in the thermotanks uh, with the temperature uh, inside about minus 140, 150 degrees. So the um, LNG with atmospheric pressure has a temperature minus 162 degrees. So it's a very good detergent. <laughs> So it should be considered when handling this kind of fuel. When you are a passenger, do you feel or see anything special in, in Megastar? I think that due to the fact that the ship will use LNG, it will uh, look very clean, it will be very green. And uh, considering the, the fact that the combustion of the fuel is different from the marine diesel oil, the noise uh, and vibration created by the main engines will be not uh, even uh, noticed on board. So we expect uh, more comfort for the passengers in every aspect.